Hi, my name is Len Brower. Please call me Len and welcome to my site. These are my methods that I have developed over many years of teaching so many people how to play both the piano and now the keyboard. Start now by listening to my arrangement of a very pretty and delicate sounding well-known alouette. Once you have listened to it, you will realize that my arrangement and lesson is aimed at mainly near beginners or people just haven't played for a while. So thanks for inviting me into your home. After all, this is a lesson in your own home. You can buy the full lesson for you to keep for only two Australian dollars. Once paid quite safely on PayPal. You can print your music and follow my lesson over and over again. Okay, let's talk about and analyze a song that's in front of you. Uh, you'll see in the right hand that there's a treble clef and a, then in the bass clef for below that for the left hand. Next to that treble clef, you'll see that there is a little sign, a flat sign, which indicates that you'll play all Bs because it is positioned on the note of B. You'll play that as a flat instead of a natural, a white note. The C next to that simply means common time or four beats, a total of four beats in every bar. Um, and then you'll see on bar nine, that's in the third line, there's like a, a, a half moon with a dot. That is a pause sign. So you're playing and you're going along. Two, three, four, hold it that little bit extra. And then you carry on with the, with the song. Okay. Um, you only have two chords in this whole piece of alouette. And F is played in the form of F and C together because they're written above each other, one above the other. And the next one, now listen to this one, this is a bit different. That is C and B flat. To an untrained ear, that could sound a little harsh or out of tune, but you get used to it and, it and it will become quite warm and full sounding. Okay, and those are the only two chords that you have throughout the whole song. Your note values, looking again at the first bar, you have a black note with a stem and a dot. That black note is worth one beat, the dot is worth half of that note, so it's a half a beat and after that you'll see there's a note that has a hook that is a half beat note and the next two notes are one beat each so they total four beats for that bar that will coincide with the left hand have a look at the left hand where you have got those two open notes well they're, they're both of the same value and they are held for four counts. So it will be one, two, and three, four. Got it? Okay. And, the other, and so we've covered the one beat notes and we've covered the half beat notes. So I think we've just about covered everything. And um, so you can now see that my method and lessons should 
become easier as you try each new song. So thank you very much for trying and I really hope that you enjoyed my piano lesson and found it interesting and also remember there are new songs of all different levels available at all the time. So till we meet again, this is Len Brower.